trolls are people on the internet. I think it is funny to annoy others only because they are so extremely sad. Five things you have to know about trolls. Trolls, you know, internet stalkers. I think it is funny to say stupid things online that are untrue, are st uh, irrational and are slanderous. First, you have to know these people are extremely sad. Trolls have no social life. That's the reason they hang around people's channels and YouTube pages because they are so sad, so miserable that they have to let them feel better on hating on somebody else. In particular, if these are people who are not can fight back because they have a mental disability or there are just uh, another kind of mindset or they are just smarter than them and they don't can understand something or somebody have just pissed them off and therefore they think ah oh, we have to do something uh, slanderous what I mean with slanderous according to the portrait red law um, that law. It is extremely illegal to use somebody this picture without their permission. In my country, where I live, for example, is it illegal to use people's pictures without their permission? And you can actually sue them for that. Hey, do you hear that? Slender forums. There are extremely narrow-minded, megalomaniac, and quite frankly, dumb. Because in the end, it will always trash in their way. One moment or another. And no of them like it when they are the victim of this. Even if you ask me, if you are doing harassment, slander, you have no right to claim you are a victim of somebody. Understand you what I mean? If you are harassing, slander, Without a reason, you give up your right up to not get the same thing done to you. Megalomania, sadism, narcissists, psychopaths. Maybe it is time for you to get a job or get one hobby. If you are sadist and you like to pay, do other people pain, go on boxing and kick people's head if you think that's funny. Because their people are going to their place to get kicked by people like you. People on the internet don't ask for you sadists. Ask for you sadists. And there are actually incapable of want to see their own mistakes and their inconsistencies. They are just on the internet to annoy and be obnoxious and harass and spread lies about others. They are the cancer of the internet. If you have once a troll on your channel, you understand what kind of people. People with extremely inflamed egos. Stupid, dumb and 
most of the time believe they are so smart. When in reality, they are dumb as fuck. Dumb as fuck. So, going in discussion with these people, don't make your day anything fun. Because most of the time, they don't want to get your point, they just want to harass, insult, say stupid stuff and make you angry. Because that's what they're like. So I say, don't feed the trolls. Because that's what I want. What you can do is if they are extremely annoying, send death rats to you. Um, call you psychopaths, uh, call you narcissists, call you insane or stupid. If you are not being that, you may be this time to block them. You have to put your lines on some places. And their opinions do not matter. If you have some trolls on your channel or on your blog, come anytime again just to say shit. Annoy them, block them, because these people will not change. They are, so I uh, say, incapable of reasoning and maybe they have too much time and their family members have to let them do charity work let them help up uh, elderly people or in us in assholes so let them help animals let them do something productive instead to annoy just the hell out of anybody and make this world to help this place. Because this kind of douchebags are toxic. I think, oh, uh, this is uh, not okay. They're attack me families and harass me families. And, uh, put all the information of me online that I do it to you. They are the most biggest hypocrites on this planet. And sometimes, if there are no trolls, there are gonna be haters. And I do not know why people want to be haters. Following somebody and then say hateful stuff against uh, somebody uh, only because uh, they have incons. Uh, themselves uh, insecurity problems maybe or their some other um, of some of some illness want some attention that's bad attention people so the best way to find some attention and now Get some reaction out of people. Is that the right thing to do? I know most people react uh, more on stuff they don't like than stuff they like. It is that the reason to make the internet to um, threshold for psychopaths, narcissists, or just stupid teenagers? I have too much time, and I have no ho have no true hobby. Sometimes I think maybe there are secret fans, because if there are not, I want them there hang around with people or uh, watch your videos just to hate you. If they are truly hating you, they want to annoy you. Say, uh, I don't follow you, I don't um, want them to do something. 
I only want to uh, be annoyed. Yeah. They are stupid. Uh, the mindset is inconsistent. If you're not like somebody, uh, when a lot of the people you're like, in particular if they are not causing harm, go away with the people. You don't like maybe me. Or you like me. If you like me, give this video a thumbs up. If you don't like me, hit subscribe and go to channels you like. Or try to understand my point of view. And understand how, how you can learn from. Don't be obnoxious people. Any miserable fool, I have nothing to be proud of. Try to find a lesser source of proud in the nation where he is born. He is ready and happy to defend all his follies and all his imperfections, those and those in order for his insecurity. I am not a troll, I am not what other people say. I am what I myself say. I'm not a politician, I don't lie. I'm not a Democrat or a Republican. I'm not left or right wing. I am not concerned so much by all that stuff because they're all full of shit maybe some parties are last full shit than others but they're all a bunch of hypocrites